or dad. It's not on? <clears throat> Have you ever had mom or dad tell you something that was frustrating? Yeah, I've done that. <laughs> Maybe. And when you ask why you have to do such a thing like chores, cleaning the living room, maybe unloading the dishwasher, what's the reason I give for why you have to do it? What do I say? What does your dad say or mom say? Because I told you so is usually the most common one. It's the one I use, right? Why do you have to change the shoes on your feet because they're backward? Because I said so, right? Or why should you clean up your toys when you're done playing with them? Because I said so. Now, is that a good reason? No? I think it is. Let me <laughs> I'm entitled to my opinion. <laughs> but tell you what, even though you don't understand why mom or dad tell you to do things, can you trust them? Yeah? You, you, you can trust them, right? Because what is the best reason why you can trust your mom or dad? Because what? Because the, they're your parents. They, they're raising you. They know you pretty well. Okay? They've They've been around for a while, right? And they're wise, but here is the most important reason you can trust them. They love you. Your mom loves you. Your daddy loves you. Huh? Yeah, and because of that love, you can trust that what they say is okay to do, right? Right. Now, Job, in our Old Testament reading today that we're going to read shortly, he was having some problems. In fact, he was having a lot of problems. And he finally said to God, why is this happening to me? I don't get it. And God told him, trust me. It's going to be okay. I'm the one who made you. I'm the one who made the stars and the whole earth. And I'm the guy in charge. You can trust me. Do you think we can trust God our Father? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Because he loves us, and he always takes care of us, right? Okay, so I want you to fold your hands and pray with me. This is going to be a repeat after me prayer, okay? Dear Heavenly Father, thank you so much for loving us, taking care of us, and sending Jesus to save us. Help us to trust you, even though it doesn't make sense. In your holy name we pray. Amen. You even got the inflection right. Good job. All right. Go ahead and be seated. Thank you so much for coming up.